Welcome into Intentional Talk. Matt McLean, the National League Player of the Week, presented by Chevrolet. Okay, so now that you've had some time to let it marinate, let it seek in, is it, is it still cool? Yeah, it's still cool. I mean, that's really all I got to say. I, I don't know what to say other than cool. Dude, uh, Matty, let me, let me tell you something. Kevin Millar here. I want to take you back to May 15th. You got your first big league hit. And yes, mm -hmm. you made a great first impression, not only selling for the single, but hustling and mm -hmm. taking that extra base the way you're supposed yep. to play this game, which is hard. And yes, right. Absolutely, yeah. You, uh, there's my parents there. My dad uh, shoved my mom off because uh, my dad saw me digging for two. <laughs> hey, dude, I got to watch you play this past weekend in Chicago, um, being there watching you play the Cubs. You got to now go to Boston and play at Fenway. You get Wrigley Field and Fenway Park. Talk about these iconic <laughs> ballparks and what it's like to be at them. Yeah. I was just telling Steer about that. I mean, it's it's awesome. I mean, every single day has been sold out that, sold out that I've uh, – played in front of all the days at Wrigley last night. I don't know. It's just it's awesome experience. So real quick now, I want to give you some Uncle Kevin advice. OK, you're at Fenway Park, played there for three yeah. years. I used to tell Manny yeah. Ramirez, who's one of the greatest right hand hitters in this game, he would always try to go to right center. It's 420 feet to right center. OK, so Matty, I'm going to give you some advice. I'm going to need you to leak a little bit that front side. You're going to keep that left shoulder in, but you're going <laughs> to leak and you're going to pull. So for this series only, okay. I want you to pull homers 308 to left, not right center. Is that a deal? I'll see what I can do. OK, <laughs> I want to take you back to your, to, to your college days, UCLA. I grew up in Los Angeles, had a bunch of buddies go to UCLA, Eric Burns, Dave Roberts, Dave Roberts, you don't know him, but he was an OK shortstop. My point is this, was that always your dream to go to UCLA, or was there a couple things that you were thinking of? Because I went to LA City Junior College. I wasn't good enough to go to UCLA. <laughs> <laughs> Uh, no, UCLA was always my dream. Uh, I grew up a fan from my dad went there and uh, I, we just grew up going to the games and uh, it's a great school with a great baseball program and uh, it was always my dream. Mm -hmm. Okay, now you have two brothers, Nick and Sean. Both of these two spent time at ASU. I personally, I'm a Sun Devil. What? Mm -hmm. You didn't know oh, that really? about me? I'm a Sun Devil. So I gotta know, who has the best parties, ASU or UCLA? Uh, UCLA, because I was there. Oh, <laughs> yeah. I thought your brother might be going first round two now. I think in Arizona, right? Yeah, well parlayed. Uh, yeah, so. Nick's pretty good. Yeah, dude. I know Nick's good. Yeah. So speaking yeah. of partying, this offseason you got to go to the Wasted Management Open <laughs> out there at ASU. <laughs> it's the best. It, it really it, is. It's yeah. the best. Talk to us it, about this. The 16th hole, there's nothing oh, there like it. It's absolutely crazy. Um, <laughs> did you have fun? Did you get any beer poured on you? I mean, can you beat uh, Kevin and no, I in the, golf? We want to know. <laughs> uh, well, yeah, the waste management was fun. It was a lot of fun. 16th hole was sick. Um, I'm not that good at golf. I like to have fun. I, I'm like a mid-80s, like high 80s. Perfect. Um, I, I can really spray it, though, like off the tee box. It's, it's wild. What is the craziest thing you saw at waste management? Ooh. Ooh. That's a really Ooh. Good uh... I'm, I think it was this year, one of the golfers uh, made a putt then lifted up his shirt. That was one of the funnier ones. Yes, I remember that. I think that was this year. I, I don't remember who it was, but that was funny. Yeah. You know, you know, I will say this. Ryan and I went there about five, eight years ago, and Ryan's a big gambler, you know, uh, and I mean really big gambler. I mean, not really yeah, big, but really be. big, you know what yeah. I'm saying? Uh, we would, he would, we had these seats in front, and what they would do is we would bet, you know, we'd throw some money out there, and which caddy would pull the stick. Yep. So it didn't matter who was going on the green uh, or close to the hole. You were screaming at the caddies because because let's say you had Tiger Woods' caddy or I had Phil Mickelson's <laughs> caddy and Ryan had whatever. And you're like, no, no, no. And whoever pulled the stick out, that's how we'd win the bet. Yeah. There's some good side bets there. I saw people doing, like, over, under the hole, a bunch of money on the table. I'm, I'm not a gambler, but, like, I saw people doing it, and I was like, Damn, this is pretty serious. Yeah, good Stay stuff. right there. If I could give you any gambling advice, stay right there. <laughs> that's <Don't> exactly <laughs> yeah. yeah. That's exactly <laughs> right. I want to ask you a question. Would you rather be John... Yeah, John McClain from Die Hard or Edwin McCann from the guy who sings I'll Be? I guess uh, Die Hard, but I, I, I got to be honest, I don't know either one. I've been told to watch Die Hard a bunch of times because we got the same last name, but I've never done it. It's a great movie. 
And, and it's a great movie. Yeah. I'm not a movie guy, but it's, it's one of the only ones I've watched. I could see you sliding <laughs> into second base and popping up and dropping a yippee ki -yay. I could see that. <laughs> yeah. Well, he's got some homework to do, but before we assign him, you know, to his Terea, let's get one last question in. Secret okay. Santos. We need you to reveal Ooh. a secret about yourself that no one knows about mm -hmm. you. Put me on the spot. That's okay. Um, We're just in a trust tree. No one's watching. No, yeah, yeah no. It can be us. about your brothers too. It's whatever. Just between us, yeah. it's just between us four. Uh, Secret bowler. Uh, you don't like vegetables. No. You love no, chocolate. No, I don't ice like cream. vegetables. You locked the brother uh, in the trunk one I like time. Mint, I like mint chocolate chip uh, ice cream. Yeah, I beat up both my brothers at once. <laughs> Yes, that's perfect. There you go. Yeah. Secret is he's like a bully. That one too. Yeah. He's a secret so a brother bully. bully. There you go. That's that's cool. Yeah, they're probably watching too. Good. Yes. They'll like Good. it. All right. Well, we'll we'll, uh. we'll reach out to them at uh, ASU. I got contacts over there. We'll find out if it's actually yeah. a map. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Ask them. All right. Right well, on. Thank you so much for the time and congratulations. Yes, sir. Yeah. Nice work. Congrats. Thank you guys for having me. Thanks. Best, I appreciate dude. it.